Hello, I am Pastor Gigi Sierra Grant, President of the Association of Asians and Pacific Islanders of the Evangelical Lutheran Church in America. I represent a community that is so culturally diverse and multilingual. We are Chinese, Indonesian, Indian, South Asian, Korean, Laotian, Hmong, Japanese, Cambodian, Thai, Filipino, and even Hawaiian of Japanese extraction. But we're all grouped together as Asians and Pacific Islanders. Since the pandemic began in March of last year, there have been more than 3,000 reported incidents of anti-Asian racism. Some of these incidents involved elderly persons being stopped, berated, harassed, spat on, coughed upon, and blamed for COVID deaths. As church together, we ask that you stand in solidarity with us against anti-Asian racism. One way of doing this is to designate a day of lament. A new ELCA worship resource has been developed for the day of lament, and it includes a prayer of blessing and healing that is so unique and beautiful. This prayer is called Embodied Blessing and Healing, created by the Interfaith Movement for Human Integrity for an anti-Asian violence protest in Oakland, California. Pastor Tita Valeriano from our own community participated in that protest and has shared this with us. The Embodied Blessing and Healing is powerful because it is movement done in silence. There are no words, but it speaks from the heart. I've invited several Asian leaders representing different caucuses to join me in showing you how to use the embodied blessing and healing. Mrs. Lily Wu, Chinese from Queens, New York. Pastor D. Gurning, Indonesian from Seattle, Washington. Pastor Daniel Penamaka, Indian from Floral Park, New York. Pastor Nuuk Va, Hmong from St. Paul, Minnesota. And Pastor Tita Valeriano, Filipina from Sacramento, California. And I'm also Filipina from Columbia, Maryland. Pastor Tita Valeriano, who serves as director for evangelical mission and assistant to the bishop in the Sierra Pacific Synod will be leading us in this demonstration. First, I will demonstrate this embodied blessing and healing with a brief meaning and you can follow me. Then we will do it together in silence and movement together. Let us begin. Take a deep breath. and exhale. Hands on one's heart. It means I see myself, acknowledge my own feelings, my own body. Bow, acknowledging sacredness, resilience, humanity, strength in myself. Look around, it means I see you. Hands to ear, it means I hear you. Arms cross chest, it means mourning, feeling collective sadness, grief, lament, anger, bow, acknowledging sacredness, resilience, humanity, strength in others. Open hands, palms up with a breath, receiving blessings from God and from one another. 
touching my heart with one hand and extending the others to yours. It means heart to heart compassion. And let us now begin this embodied blessing and healing together in silence. Let us begin by taking a deep breath. And God's people say, Amen.